Lieutenant Zachariah Manser. I think congratulations are in order. Captain Eliza Major, welcome to my unit. The honor is mine, Captain. For now, we're stationed in town and focusing on missions intended to maintain order and safety among the civilians. Here are the two other fine soldiers making up your unit for the time being, David Ward and Jeffrey Hunter. My pleasure, Lieutenant! Congratulations, and... Leave the ass-kissing for later, soldier. Lieutenant? Yes, sir, Captain. Excellent. Moving on to more pressing matters, our mission just came in, and it's aimed at smothering regime opposition. According to the intel the ASC gave us, those terrorists live in the slums and are plotting several attacks to undermine our corporation. Your mission is to infiltrate the terrorists, stop the attacks, and find your way to their leader, Bulgakov. Orders are to capture Bulgakov alive. We're going to drain him for intel about other terrorist cells and dismantle the entire network. So beat him only as much as you need to take him. You got it, Captain. Move quickly. The longer you take, the more risk there is to the citizens of Ophir. And I won't have that. Before you go, though, there's one more mission. One requiring speed and discretion. We have deserters in our ranks, Lieutenant. Deserters planning to flee like rats through the city's underground. That won't happen. Do you understand me? You find them, and you eliminate them. Each and every one. If that seems harsh to you. Setbacks against Aurora have ruined our reputation, to the point that every action we take is scrutinized and extorted by those seeking to gain from our fall. A mass desertion would spell scandal if it became public. You catch them before any word of their escape comes out. So move, now! You only have a few hours. That's not war. It's just fucking murder. Killing our own, crushing their heads on our way up some goddamn corporate ladder. Fuck it, I'm out. Soldier, get back here now. You already back, Lieutenant Zachariah? Captain, report? Yes, Lieutenant. Rest assured, potential scandal's been abolished. Everything's in order. We managed to neutralize most. Some, unfortunately, escaped. Then you didn't act quickly enough. It should have been your priority, Lieutenant. Because of your failures, all we can do now is hope that the word doesn't spread. But what was the fate of the sergeant in charge of the group? Sergeant Boris? You'll be pleased to hear that he's been eliminated, as requested. I'm glad to hear my expectations were met. As hard as it must have been to carry out those orders. It's never easy to take the life of one of your own. Even if he was a coward and a traitor. He did well. Saved us from scandal. My trust was well placed. Quartermaster has your pay. Go get it. It was well earned. You missing a soldier, Lieutenant? Before you can respond, the answer is yes. David Ward. You should probably find him before I do. Consider yourself a shepherd, Lieutenant. One of your flocks gone. Find him. Do it quick before it has to become official. Do I make myself clear? Consider him already found, Captain. Good. Moving on. We have new missions. Bit of a welcome change from the big chases. We've got state officials arriving in Ophir today, and an ASC warning that an influx of Aurora spies in the city are planning trouble. For security, the officials will be picked up in rovers outside the city and brought to the hangars, rather than coming through the station. We've got brigades tracking the spies, but you're gonna have to usher them through the slums and make sure they get to our quarters safely. No excuses. No failures. We clear? Questions, Lieutenant? At your command, Lieutenant. David Ward hasn't reported in. Do you have any idea where I could find him? Well, I don't know where, but I might know why. He was really close to that Boris guy who got himself killed. 
I think he fought with the guy on the front or something. Where was Boris even save Ward's life at some point? I, I bet he just overreacted, Lieutenant. Can't hold it against him. It's hard to lose a friend, especially like that. I just figure he's probably... I just want to find him, Jeff, before he gets labeled a deserter. Soldier. Lieutenant? I'm looking for Private David. I know you know him pretty well, and if I don't find him soon, he could be in a lot of trouble for deserting. You got any idea what's going on? Lieutenant, I, I can't really... Stop talking and listen. I'm not looking to get him in trouble, soldier. I'm looking to get him out of it. Yes, sir. Well, Dave goes to the Curiosities a lot when he's on leave. Not exactly a getaway, but, you know, it does the job for him. Maybe he's there. Thank you, soldier. I'll check it out. I don't get it. I don't get how Dave could screw you over like this, Lieutenant. I mean, I know he's been feeling down with Boris's death and all, but... The captain looked worried, and I'm betting this is all gonna come down on you. David doesn't like us. Not that I blame him, considering all the shit I've asked him to do. But the other problem's that he doesn't even like himself. A soldier who doesn't care about himself's a problem. Well, if we find him and bring him back, I'll help get his self-confidence back again. I promise. Right now, I just want to find him. Deal with the rest later. Lieutenant? How happened to you, Dave? Captain's about to call you a deserter. Fuck if I care, Lieutenant. Who the hell are you? Show up with your pretty title and execute Boris like a goddamn dog? You didn't know the guy. You didn't see him fight on the front line like I did. The guy had courage. Real courage. Cared about his fellow men. You? What are you to me? You're less than I am. David, listen to me. I'm not defending what went down. ASC's been keeping an eye on everyone, especially the army. If we left Boris alive, they'd have gotten their hands on him. And what they would have done, you know this, would have been far worse. Is that true? Why the hell's the ASC interested in soldiers? Thought they just went after the rebels and other corporations. So what? You saying they would have tortured him? To them, there's no difference between a deserter and a rebel, Dave. Especially in times of war. Might want to consider that yourself. Head back to the barracks. Yeah. All right. Sure. Thank you, Lieutenant. Never thought a guy like you would even take a moment's thought for a guy like me. Lieutenant? I want to know my men better. Tell me a bit about yourself. Oh, great. Show and tell. Yay. What do you do when you're off duty? Nothing special. See my folks, I guess. They ain't getting any younger, so... And I give most of my paycheck to them, because I'm the only one they got left. Sister died. And I ain't married, so... When I ain't with them, I'm at the bar. Drowning the shitstorm that my life's become. Not exactly a picture-perfect life, but it's mine. And hell, I get paid enough to help them out and buy my own drinks, so... What's there to complain about? What do you think about Jeffrey Hunter? He's a village idiot who thinks he can brown-nose his way to a promotion. Fucking reject. And no, he ain't my friend, if you haven't pieced that together. I'm gonna leave you alone. Seems you'd rather be that way anyway. Lieutenant? I want to know about your childhood. You really want to know about my childhood? Sure, yeah, why not? My dad was never around. He was either on the front or doing drills. My mother, though, she was stationed here in Ophir. So we lived in a guard outpost in the slums where she worked. I never expected to make more of myself than become a soldier. I fought a lot as a kid. Had my share of girls. But home life was pretty strict, so I tried to toe the line. Mostly because when I fucked up, I never got off easy. So when'd you join? Five years ago. Time fucking flies, don't it? It was in 126. My parents were beaming with pride. Pride that's faded when, after all this time, I'm still just a fucking private. 
Jesus. How old are you? The fuck does it matter to you? Older than you, though. And the rest you can find in my file. Cool, moving on. Lieutenant? I know you're a drinking man, so what do you say we go grab one together? Looks like it's my lucky day. Sure, why the hell not? Lead the way. So why don't you cut the bull and tell me why we're really here? Sure. You've been spying on me, Dave. I've been reporting everything back to Victor. I don't like racks. That's not all right with me. And what? You think I ever had a choice in the matter? Think I had the option to say no? I don't care. All I know is they got all the intel they wanted on me from one of my own soldiers, and I don't know why. What's your angle, Dave? You bitter you got a mancer as your lieutenant? I thought we were past all that. What'd they promise you? Promotion? Better pay? Nothing but a promise they wouldn't hurt my parents. Is that a good enough reason? I don't like the ASC. Don't like what they're doing to Abundance. Don't like what they're doing to me. I don't like the deal they offered, and I don't like that I didn't have a choice but to accept it. I ain't got no one but my folks since my sister died. Not that I expect you to shed a tear for me, but... If I gotta choose between them and you... Sorry, brother. You're on the losing end of that. If it helps, though, I don't think you're the full prick you were before we had this little chat. In fact, I might even have liked you in another time and place. But you're in deep shit now. And it's shit I don't want to get pulled into with you. I don't want your blood on my hands, David. But I can't let you keep doing what you're doing. So I'm just gonna tell you to get the hell out of Ophir and don't look back. I don't... sure. Yeah, sure. Bye, Lieutenant. Dave! Lieutenant! What? You left a fear too? With the ASC on my ass, yeah. Sorry to hear that. I still owe you my life. Then maybe you could help me out. You seen anything strange lately? Rumors going around that some Vori found their way into Noctis. Yeah. Yeah, I thought some faces looked familiar. Just the other day, there was a tough-looking guy I swore I'd seen near Anton Rogue's warehouse. It was, uh... That's right. It was in that weird corner area where those mutants and, um... Uh, what are they called? Those, uh, ostriches are. You know, along the main street heading to the gates? Around there. If it's who I think it was, I hope you get him out. I'll give it a look. Good to see you, Dave. Thanks for the help. You too, Lieutenant. Take care. Dave! Dave! 